everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you how to make sort of one of those healthy rice chicken burrito bowls, except instead of doing plain chicken, we're going to make like a cheesy chicken. It is so good, a healthy meal that you can make and eat throughout the week. You can, you know, put all the leftovers in the fridge and keep making it. The coolest thing about cooking your own food is you know everything that goes in it. Knowing all that, you want to eat the food you make rather than just go out and spend money um, on bad food that's not going to be good for you. And even if it is healthy, like they say, we don't know exactly what they put into it. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. So the first thing I'm doing is brining my chicken. All you do is put warm water in a bowl with salt and then let your chicken soak in there. You should do it between five and 15 minutes. I usually just will let it soak while I'm getting my ingredients together and while I am putting the oven on. It makes the chicken come out like restaurant quality. It's, it's amazing, don't skip this step. So while my chicken brines, I'm going to be heating up some butter. I personally don't like cooking chicken without butter. I know some people don't like using butter and think that it's unhealthy. So I did put alternatives what you can use instead. Honestly guys, it's one of those things that my family has used forever and I just, I don't, I can't see myself not cooking chicken in butter. Plus, you're only having one chicken breast a night. I don't, I'm not eating this entire plate. But of course, use whatever you're comfortable with, always with cooking. This is the best part of cooking is you get to design how you want it. So now I'm seasoning my chicken with paprika and garlic salt. Of course, you guys know I always use garlic salt. And I make sure to season both sides of the chicken. So now we're going to be making our cheese on top. So you wanna mix a cup of sour cream and a cup of cheddar cheese in a bowl. And you're only going to be putting this on one side of the chicken breast and kind of just painting it on. Okay, here's where you can get funky. If you have another cheese in your refrigerator that you wanna use, you can put it on top and it'll just melt over, but I'm just gonna stick with the same one just for budget reasons, you only need to buy one. So for me and my oven, I cook it for 21 minutes on 450 heat. Okay, so while that's in the oven, we're going to make our grain and our rice. So the one I'm using is a quinoa and wild brown rice blend, but I am going to be putting different price points of pretty much the same thing, but for a cheaper price. I like this big tub though because I've had it for over a month and I feel like you get a lot for your money. So I'm just following the directions how you make it. It says to mix salt, water, and a little bit of butter. Okay, so then you take the chicken out and oh my God, it was so amazing. I can't wait to have it again for dinner tonight. So then I just wash some lettuce and that's what I put in the bowl first. And then I mix in my quinoa and you can add in any other vegetables that you might have. I just didn't want this to have a million ingredients. I just want it to be something super simple. And there you have it, a nice, well-balanced budget meal. You have your protein, you have your lettuce, and you have your grains. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out my website where I sell my meal plans for more simple, easy meals. I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye.